Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the RVT Game Crew. It's the Shades and Maddie J here. T Dub well, may join us eventually. We don't know yet. <laughs> it's going to be one of those. Yeah, nights. Well, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but tonight, we're going to do. We're going to jump back on the indie scene with me because you know that's how I roll. And tonight, we're playing the Binding of Isaac. More specifically, the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus. Uh, for those who've never played this game, uh, Afterbirth uh, uh, Binding of Isaac is a roguelike game. And, and I use that definition and sincerely because I actually just saw uh, Total Biscuit's comments about roguelikes. <laughs> uh, you just put out a video about that recently. But basically, this is a very Zelda-esque type adventure where you travel in dungeons, you battle monsters, and you it's you know all randomly generated. So how we're going to do this is I'm going to do several runs. How many per video? I don't know. It depends on how often I get my ass kicked. <laughs> 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 this game is not exactly for for newcomers. This is not a newbie friendly game. This game will kick your ass. This game is entirely Let's put it this way. Huh? Let's put it this way. Have you folks watched Rogue One? <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, not me, unfortunately. <laughs> well, spoiler the spoiler, they got the plans. Yeah, well, I think that goes without saying anyway. <laughs> so Basically, you're going to go through a number of characters, and basically everything, is, aside from your character that you select, is randomly generated. What items you'll find, what monsters you face, what rooms you go through, what bosses you fight, with the exception of, like, the big bosses. So, to start things off, we're going to go with... We're going to go with Judas on this one. And we're going to play on... As much as I hate to do it, I think we're going to have to play on hard mode. So, prepare to okay. see me get my ass kicked a lot. So, wait, Judas as in Judas Priest? <laughs> Funny. Ooh, well, we're getting a little bit of luck right out the gate. We start here right next to the item room. Hmm. So go over here, let's see what we got. Oh, damn it, Curse of the Blind! Oh, no. Every once in a while, you may get a random curse. You'll see at the bottom it says Curse of the Blind. Basically, I don't know what item that is. It could be anything. Crush fingers. Eh, D8, not too bad. But let's see if we can't. We got a we got a reroll machine right here. So I'm gonna spend a couple coins, see if we can get something a little bit better. Crush, crossing fingers again. Clicker! Change. I honestly don't know what that does. Well, hopefully it doesn't it doesn't change the channel. Whoa! What the Hey, 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 hey. Oh, I think it changed my character. Oh, no. It's not entirely a bad thing, but we'll take back the Book of Belial, because I don't... Yeah, because now I'm Kane. I can see why you can see the uh, the, the Zelda, uh, Zelda-esque of it. And also, is this the poop room? <laughs> You're going to find a lot of shit in this game. I mean that in multiple ways. Okay. The basic story for this goes, because I know you didn't see the intro, Maddie, is that basically Isaac here, Isaac, who basically this character is dressing up as as Cain, but he's Isaac, lives with his mm -hmm. mom. His dad, his dad left them, and his mom is a very religious zealot. Oh, one of those. Yeah, one of those types. Watches a lot of Christian programming. And one day, she hears what she presumes to be the voice of God telling her to kill her son. So, she goes after him with a kitchen knife. And you jump down, and, and Isaac jumps down into the basement to get away. Oh, shit. Ow, fuck. All right, I'm going to bomb this, because that right there is a marked rock. Marked rocks can have, oh, it usually has items in it. And I die. Oh. That's the other aspect of this game. Permadeath. You only get one life. There are technically extra lives in this game, but you only start with one. Period. Wow. And when we restart, we get a brand new run. Completely different. Now we have Curse of the Labyrinth, which is actually not one of the one of the is actually one of the more decent curses because what that does is it it's it's two floors combined into one larger floor so basically this is the basement he runs into 
Yep. And here we got Mom's Eye, which randomly will ha shoot out the back of my head, which is actually a pretty decent item. Ah, fuck. Alright, now. Unfortunately, I took some damage, which is very bad because I only have one health, one heart. Dude. Yeah, you see that now, huh? <laughs> Gotta be careful in this game. What it also did is you see my stats there on the right, on the left side. Yeah. Uh, you see the upside down cross. That is a random chance at a deal with the devil. At the end of a boss room, in this case the second boss, because we'll be finding two bosses on this floor. Mm -hmm. If you have a random, if depending on your percentage, you have a random chance of a dark of a black door appearing. There, you have a chance to sacrifice hearts, sacrifice your health for powerful items. Really powerful items. Usually some of the best items of the game. All right, random pill. Let's see what we got. Oh, luck down. Did not need that. Oh. All right, but we got a turret follower now. We got Papa Fly. The little bug that's going to be following us around. And he'll shoot shit for us. Oh, shit. Portals. Nice. Beware the portals. This was a new thing added. Oh, never mind. I'm dead. <laughs> Uh, you were you were saying wait wait I'm so you're saying those portals are blagos? Actually, quite the opposite because they spawn shit instead of sucking you in. Oh okay. Yeah, they spawn random enemies. Oh, we start with this sucker. Oh. Ah oh, damn it, Mark's rocking me without a bomb. So we get something good Aww. here. Ooh, that's not too bad. Odd mushroom increases my fire rate. Means I'll shoot a little faster. That'll actually help. It does lower reduce my damage a little bit though, but. The increased fire rate. Hey, more bullets it. means more damage. Yeah, it, it balances itself out. It didn't reduce my damage that badly, so I should be okay. This is what happens when you play on hard mode, folks. This game will kick your ass. Ooh. Okay. I'm going to hold on to this key because I could go into that shop right there because that's the shop room right there next to me. Also, I've got But you don't have enough to, to actually buy stuff. Yeah, not much. I could get another key in there if I'm lucky, but I'm gonna save it. Oh, hey, T Dub. Anyway. He died. He died twice. <laughs> yes, but unlike you, I'm playing a game that is designed to kick your ass, so it's justified. He died for our sins, especially in a game like this. Okay, I got a second key. So now that I've got two keys, I'm gonna go ahead and go into that shop. Because I want to make sure I have at least one key for the next floor. I'll show you why later. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, oh. oh, I need to get some money and fast. This Good item right you. here, tarot cloth. Very useful item if I can get my hands on it. Is this, uh, which version of Isaac is this? This is uh, Afterbirth Plus. Oh, is this the most recent upda update? Yes, though I have no mods installed on this one. I'm avoiding using mods until I can get everything first, which is probably going to take me a while this room. Oh, boss, I think. Huh? Is that the boss? No, no. Boss will have a health bar. Oh, you guys want to know why I was late? Why? Because I was waiting for a video uh, to uh, export because I didn't know if you were going to have one ready or not. Ah, okay. Well, I did. Actually recording this live, and I'm probably about to die. Whoa, shit, 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 shit. Whoa. <laughs> this room is probably going to kill oh. me. Bum 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 ba da da Isaac! I'm actually surprised I'm still alive at this point. Holy crap. Is that timer how long you've been alive? Yeah. That's a lot of shit. Oh, this game's full of shit. In more ways than one. Okay, I gotta watch out for the little monstro there. That's a big pile of shit. That, that was the reference I was going for, yes. Ooh, that's Money! what I'm looking for. Money! Oh, luck up, too. Nice, I got a lucky coin. Sometimes a coin will uh, randomly give you a luck up. Oh, I need thank you health. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There is a really bad joke I want to make now, but I'm not going to do it because it's not worth it. Right, let's go up in here. Some more of these guys. So basically, we're watching a, a, an indie port version of Super Smash TV. That's actually not a bad way of uh, bad way to describe it. Yeah, this is a lot like Smash TV. 
Ooh, bomb. Okay, I know exactly where I'm going with this. Excuse me a minute. Oh, fuck. Actually, this works out. That's exactly what I need. It's right there. Place that there. Boom. Ooh, another bomb and a key. I'll take that. Da -da -da -da. Hey, got your bomb back. Very nice. And if I remember correctly... Yeah, so this, this really looks like a Smash TV cross with Zelda. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much a good way to look at it. Ah, here we go. Remember, there was a second one of these. Oh, that's what I'm looking for. Soul Hearts. Soul Hearts are, are, are regular health, but unlike the Red Hearts, they're ir they cannot be replenished. If you lose a full heart, that's it's gone. Oh, that... That sucks. Not entirely. Actually, soul hearts are usually preferred over regular hearts. Oh. Oh, shit. All right. Oh. Well, oh, the, not much the, else the... I can do here, so boss time. Oh, pin. That's a good boss to start with. Oh, and your uh, your skin is called Judas. Yep. This game is chock full of biblical references. Actually, before I forget, let me activate this, the Book of Belial. That'll increase my damage Ooh. for this room. Nice. Oh, you know what? This is actually a good time to get this. Experimental to treat it. As you can see, it randomly shuffled my stats. Lower my damage a little bit, but increased my luck, my fire, my uh, shot speed, and my uh, walking speed. Very nice. Not a bad trade-off. And down deeper and deeper we go. Yep, time for the second level of the basement. Actually, oh, we got the burning basement and curse of the unknown. I no longer know what my health is. Wow, fantastic. Oh yeah, these curses will own you. Another marked rock here, we'll blend, blow that up. Ooh, gold chest. You know what, I got enough keys for it. Ooh, sack of pennies. And I just realized I forgot to go back to the shop. Well, then again, I don't have enough money anyway, so fuck it. So let's see what's in the uh, arcade. What? So what does the sack of pennies do? Every once in a while, it'll drop coins. Oh, nice. All right, you know what? Sir, in the middle of the room, you are very creepy. <laughs> Hi. And that sack of meat just literally walked right into the flames. Nicely done, buddy. <laughs> just wouldn't kill himself for me. Meat wad is dead. <laughs> Pretty much. Let's see here. Let's go over here. Oh, okay. Item room. I just clear these guys out real quick. Especially these ones that are on fire. Gotta watch out. These guys jump far. But thankfully, because they're blind, they don't jump towards you. I just gotta kill these suckers real quick. So is this game a music or are you just muting it on our end? Oh, I forgot to send it on your end. Wait, wait, give me two seconds. Ah, oh, much better. Yeah, this is why I said I needed keys. Because after the first floor, the item rooms are locked off. Ooh! Ooh, this By is tempting. Way. This is tempting. By the yeah. way, I hope that the uh, at least your recorder was picking up the music. Oh, yeah, it is. It is. Oh, it's... Also, oh, the knife. You want the knife, but it gives you some. But you have to lose it. No, what it is is that's mother's knife. It's, you know what? Because I'm playing on hard mode. Fuck it. I'm not gonna try. I'm not gonna risk it. I no longer have tears. I use mother's knife. Yeah, it's no longer a rapid fire, but uh, I assume it has more power. Oh yeah, it, it has its own independent strength, and yet it's also a, in, is increased depending on your actual power uh, strength strength stat. But in and of itself, it is a powerful weapon because it does a lot of damage. The only problem is, is that it's a synergy killer. So the thing about this game is a lot of these items can synergize and they can create some devastating combinations if you have the right ones. Mother's Knife, while the expansions have improved it a bit, it's still not a very synergizable weapon. All right, because there's a bomb there, I'm going to go ahead and blow this up. Grab that. Ooh, that is a nice wet item to have. Infamy, damage reduction. Nice. Definitely could use that right about now. Okay, let's see what we got here. Uh, and as lover of masks, I approve. Yes. You know what? I don't like these items. Let's see if we can get something a little bit better to work for. Uh, Might save up for the map. That might come in handy later. 
Also. Oh, this, uh, this soundtrack is actually pretty good. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Oh, shit, the portals again. Get rid of you as quickly as you can. You know, he's, uh, you know, John, you know, Tito, I was calling them black holes. Well, I was gonna say, I thought we were done with portals by now. <laughs> no, in this case, we can't think with the portals. They, they're thinking against us. In Soviet Russia, portals think of you. Ooh! That one exploded. I need and a key. Nice. Have you ever wondered why in video games never use a key, it just disappears? I've always questioned that myself. Yeah. All right, boss time. Larry Jr. Oh, that's a good boss that man. I'm getting lucky on the bosses here. This guy's fast, but he's kind of stupid. Uh, let's see, Larry Jr. That, that is one ugly son of a Cooper. Ooh, a chest. I didn't expect that. What do we got here? Ooh, soul heart. I'll take that, especially considering what I'm about to do here. All right, I'm going to save oh, wait, that dog. I'm going to save that dog food there because that actually will give me health. So let's see what's in here. Really? That's it? Zombie baby? You want me to get this um, up for zombie baby? Fuck you! I'm honestly surprised no one has said so hard. Yeah, I'm not taking the zombie baby because that's that's a decent item, but not really worth it. Uh, what's the stat? It's it's, it's not a stat; it's a follower. Oh. He follows you around and shoots flies out at you. I could have oh. used it, but eh, I don't. Oh shit! Oh fuck! I see I see a boarded up room. I'm gonna need two bombs for that. Actually, I'll probably need three because if there's a, if it's the bedroom, then there might be a chance for a uh, crawl space. Crawl spaces can randomly appear when you blow up rocks and shit. Ooh. Ah, uh, see, this is why I needed the terra cloth. Death. That might be helpful for certain rooms. Oh shit! Oh shit! <sighs> And it says 13 death, okay? Um, yeah, I agree. Final Fantasy 13 was death. <laughs> well, you know... Alright, let's see what's in here. Fuck yeah, it was. Yep, sure enough, it's the bedroom. If I get another bomb, I'll come back here, because I'm going to want that... I want to check that under the rug. So, what is the purpose of bedrooms? They can restore your health if you're running low. Uh, by sleeping in the bed, and the rug can sometimes have a, uh, a hatch underneath, whether it be the, an exit to the next floor, or even better, the crawl space. Uh, what is uh, crawl space used for? Crawl space has two potentials. Uh, either it can be a um, an item room, or a free item, like, in, like a, it, it'll look something like The Legend of Zelda, or it could have a pathway to another area called the Black Market. And I assume that means rare items. Oh, yes. Range up. Okay, got range up. That's good. What's this one? Perks. Not really that useful. Let's see what's in here. Ooh. 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 I know what that is. And if I can get two more coins, that is going to be a nice little treat. That big girl right there is Mama Mega. Blows up everything. It's a major, it's a big bomb that goes off in every room. When you say every room. Ooh, crawl space. Come on, black market, black market, black market, black market. Damn it. Oh, yeah, it is very Zelda. Yep. And we got mom's locket. It's a trinket. It's a special item. It's a carryable item. Oh, shit. I just realized I spent my money on bombs or on that bomb, so I don't have enough to save up for get Mama Mega. I'm definitely going to want that, though. Oh, fuck! You took a full heart of damage and I'm dead. Well you, made, well, you made 11 minutes, so... Yeah, I think I'm going to play on easy mode for, or normal mode for right now. Uh, what were you playing on earlier? Hard mode. Hard mode. Ah. Uh, I see there is no easy mode. It's just normal, hard, greed, and greedier. Yeah, greed and greedier are a special kind of gauntlet mode. So we won't be dealing with that too much. And I'm fuck you. And no, I am not playing this son of a bitch. This guy will be my not will be a nightmare when I get to him. Keeper. The keeper and the loss are the two hardest characters to play as. Period. Okay then. So instead, Ooh, actually, let's do. 
Oh, we haven't done a Zazel yet. Let's do a Zazel. You guys don't like a Zazel. Zazel's badass. He flies. He's got three black hearts, which do to damage the whole room if you lose one whole heart. And he shoots lasers. Ah, very nice. Oh, fuck. That was a bad start. By the way, uh, Supernatural fans are getting triggered by the name of Zazel. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, the blank card. That's... Is... I'm guessing that could be anything. Basically, uh, it it allows you to duplicate whatever card you have in your possession. Right now, it's kind of useless because the card I have is the Fool, which only takes me back to the start of the level. Kind of useless here. Oh, that was close. Ooh, Pulse Worm. Does that work on this? Not really. I need I need the full I need the full Brimstone Beam for that. Oh shit. As bad as that shit smells, I imagine it would smell even worse now that it's melted. Yeah. Also, those were troll bombs. I think that goes without saying what those do. Mm-hmm. The and bigger troll bombs very... like that one you saw follow you. Also, I noticed that because you fly, you can go over obstacles. Yes. Another reason why Azazel is an awesome character. Man, I get nothing on this floor. Jesus. Uh, what about the treasure chest? I, I assume that takes money to open. Takes... Takes a key. Ah. I, think it's I, a no, I got Plus no key. Gamers. I got one coin, no keys, no bombs. I am fucked. Thank God Azazel's a relatively strong character. Ah, oh, Little Horn. As you can see, this guy oh, kind of pops just... around, goes in and out of holes. He'll throw he'll throw little black balls at you, and occasionally he'll drop troll uh regular troll bombs, which don't follow you, but are still a pain in the ass. And you're just going straight through him. That's the power of the of the brimstone beam. Are you sure that's not the power of love? Ooh, torn photo, tears and shot speed up. That means I mean I'll charge my beam faster. Certainly not an unwelcome item. We'll make this the last run for this episode. Alright, now. How it normally works is on this floor, we have to start being very conscious of our health. Though, thankfully, because I have no red hearts, I don't have to worry too much because I'm at no risk of losing the deal of the devil. You only, lose the, you only reduce your de deal of the devil chance if you lose red hearts. Since I have none, uh. I've got nothing to worry about. So this character is pretty much OP. It's considered one of the most OP characters, at least in normal runs. For uh, greed mode runs, there's another character that's even more OP if you know how to use them. Is this and is Azazel unlocked by default, or do you have to do something to unlock you him? You have to unlock them uh, through specific means. Thankfully, it's not too complicated. Oh sh! Ah, oh, fuck! Curse of the blind. Are you, are you gonna take it? I'm gonna I'm gonna clear the way first, but let's just pray it's something good. Uh, that's cr that's not too bad. Let's see what I get out of it. Besides, I'm not like I'm gonna use the fool anyway. Cross your fingers. Oh, health up! I'll take that. Also, fool! You fool! Also, I just realized something. Yes, he shoots lasers, but it looks like he pukes lasers. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, shit. Oh, I hate. Thank God I can fly, or these guys would really be a pain in my ass. Oh, regular yeah, troll bomb. I yeah, I've noticed in this game, if it looks like something disgusting is going on, it probably is. Oh yeah, this game is very crude. Let's see, you know what? I've already found the shop and the... Or, found where the shop and the item room is. I'm going to hold on to my key because I only have the one. And I want to make sure I can access the item room later. Item rooms are much better off. So who are we fighting? Oh. Monstro! Oh, fucking, he's not coming alone. Although it's disgusting as this game is, it still does not top out last. Oh, no, no, no. This is not the most disgusting, but this game does not pull its punches. Alright, the trick to this guy is he likes to shoot in random in random bl blasts of shots, as you can see, so you got to kind of be careful with him. It's basically a glorified shockwave. Yeah. More like a shotgun, but I can kind of see your point there. Alright. I'm gonna hold off getting that deal, with the uh, getting that item, because it might be a health up item, and I might need that here in a minute. So what's in here? Oh fuck. Okay. 
I'm going to take my chance on this item here because I'm only going to lose the one heart. But it might be something really good. Satanic Bible, reusable evil. You know what? For my character, that actually works pretty good. I think I'll take, I'll keep that. And Jesus Juice, damage and range up. I don't think that's going to affect my Brimstone Beam as far as the range goes, but the damage is certainly going to be helpful. Oh, yes, the Jesus Juice. <laughs> funny, funny. All right, suits in here. Ooh, tempting. You know what? Fuck it. Let's go for it. Oh, yes, Guppy's Tail. Increased chances of, of chests appear. Oh, and I got... Oh, fuck Krampus! Damn it! Krampus, the superior Christmas mascot. Every once in a while, when you go into a deal with the devil room, you have a random chance of fighting this son of a bitch instead of getting any items. But he also... Ooh, that's the one item... He also has a chance... He also can drop one of two items when he's killed. Either uh, Krampus' head, which is a super powerful laser, but not really that useful... Or the Lump of Coal, which actually will increase the damage the farther away your shot is. Not too useful for Azazel, but I'll take it. Now, since I don't, since I know there's no other point in opening that other chat, actually... You know what? I got enough help. Ah, damn it. Troll bombs. I was kind of hoping I can get one of the other... Red chests have several things. They can drop... Tro uh, they can be nothing. They can have uh, spiders come out. and They can have troll bombs come out. They can also have stuff of dropping coins a random chance to teleport you to a devil deal or can sometimes have items that would normally be found in devil deals. So there's a lot of potential with those red chests. It's a risk. It's a good risk reward system with those. And the risk is not too high, but the rewards are pretty good. So it's usually a good idea to get those if you if, to go for red chests if you see them. All right. Be careful with these guys because these guys will shoot the little. Basically, they shoot the worms on their heads out of them. Those look quite vaginal. They are intended yeah. to be. Yeah. They are intended to be. And I don't have any key, so I can't open that chest. That's one downside of the cup to the guppy's tails. If... Ow! That was too close. And now they are the dead. Thankfully, I've got my my uh, satanic Bible, so I can get more health. Fuck! Satanic Bible, never leave home without it. I know I don't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you see, I'm getting a lot more gold chests appearing. The only problem is, is I grabbed it when I don't have any keys, so it's probably going to backfire on me. God damn it! Ooh, key! Uh, you know what? I'm going to save it, though, because I want to make sure I get to the item room first. Item rooms are a guaranteed item. Gold chests are not. At least not until the final floor. Really? Is... Is that is that a piece of shit? Yes, it is. Suits in the stone chest. So that's pretty much the game flipping you the bird. Pretty much. I am not taking it. Actually, no. Is that the... Actually... You know what? Screw that. I actually will take that. It gives me more bombs. I was thinking that was the other item. Uh, okay, then. <laughs> yeah, this game is uh, rather weird and disgusting. Well, I've heard of uh, of of pulling bombs out of your ass, but this is, this is ridiculous. I picked the wrong week to stop sniffing glue. <laughs> <laughs> more keys. I will take more keys. Ooh, eternal hearts. If I hold if I get a second one or hold on to that until the end into the next floor, I will get a full I will get a full replenishable heart. Eternal. Eternal. I was hoping for. Ooh, actually, you know what? Let me blow this up. That'll stun him a little bit. Ooh, regular chest. Let's see what we get. Ooh, keys and bombs. I'll take that. Also, gotta make sure I finish this one off. Gold chest or gold piles of poop will give you either get them coins or, it or items related to coins. Let's see. I don't think. Uh, problem is, I don't know where the secret room is. So I'm not gonna try for it. Let's see what we got. Last here. time. Rag Ooh. Mega. 
bosses. One of the new bosses introduced in Afterbirth Plus. Ah, Maddie, okay. you know what this is, right? What is it? It's the Yeti! The Yeti! Well, unlike the Yeti, I'm the one that's doing the humping this time because I just fucked his ass. <laughs> Experimental treatment, gotta take the chance. Ooh, nice combo out of that. A little loss of damage, John but... John855 says, I just fucked your ass. <laughs> <laughs> well, so obviously we had Krampus earlier, so we're going to go down. And now we're going to go to the second second set of floors. Or no, actually, we already went there. We are in the caves. Now we're in the second half of that. The flooded caves. And as I said, I have my eternal heart, so I get a full heart out of that. And we got right next to the item room. Eh. You know what? Juicy sack. I'll take that. Phrasing! <laughs> it's a, a juicy lot of that. sack indeed. Ooh, oh, lucky God. break the small rock. Damage increase. The more you say luck, the more just no. That just looks nasty. That's nasty. It's really everywhere. Good this actually, we're actually doing much better on this run. Alright, not much there, so let's move on here. Oh, there we go. Ha! I gotta be a lot more careful. I'm getting real on health here. Too many of those freaking flies. You know, one thing I just noticed, the score goes up and down. Yep. Up. Oh, paralysis. Useless in, a, in an empty room because, well, there's nobody to take advantage of it and it's only temporary. Paralysis, I'm sure that's Bill Cosby's favorite. Oh! oh. Hate these mushrooms they are they are tanks they can take a ton of damage look at that full blast shot and it still stood can't imagine what it'd be like finding that thing on the weakest setting and now for a legion of spiders right, i got a feeling this is going to be something good aha the super oh, secret it's room. everywhere no Oh god, the butt juice! It's everywhere! It's ah, in my it's god, yeah. like yes. Well, enemies in the shop? That's just bullshit. <laughs> Welcome to the Binding of Isaac, asshole! This game like, don't play nice. Dark, not even Dark Souls does that. <laughs> even that game knows to give you a safety save. <laughs> Again, get used to it. This game likes to fuck with you. Ooh, more luck. Yes. Okay, don't need the ladder. Don't need that. You know what? I'm going by the battery so I can get more health. More black hearts. Now I feel a little more comfortable going into the boss room. What do we fight? So what about the spiders? Big horn. Oh, you thought little horn was a little bit of a was a dick. This guy is your worst fucking nightmare. Bad touch, bad touch, bad touch. Yeah. Take everything you you hated about Little Horn and amplify it, and you get this asshole. All right, didn't get to deal with the devil this time. I'll go ahead and take the health. Mmm, moldy bread, just like how Mama used to make. <laughs> Oh, you weren't here for the story. Mom's out to kill us. Yeah, yeah, I'm very well aware of the story. Okay, cool. At the very least. And how... I think MapHat may have not actually done a video on this. He did. Oh, fuck. Troll Bomb! Oh, and these sucker... Oh, and these guys, too. Remember... -la 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 -la. Actually, thankfully, because I had the Brimstone laser, these guys aren't as big of a threat. More Troll Bombs! God damn it! Come on, give me something good in the last one. Oh, you son of a bitch! Oh, fuck. <laughs> All right. This game really hates you. Yes, it does. This game hates everybody. You want to see how this game could piss somebody off? Go look up Tier Grace on YouTube. He's a YouTuber who 
does a lot of different games, but he's mostly known for his Isaac runs. And oh mm. god, the rage that can come out of that son of a bitch. Uh, this game must be an absolute nightmare to speed run. Uh, it's not much. It's not really known for speed running because unless you do a seated run. Because like any good random generated game, there is a seed. So if you guys want to play this run and see how well you can do on this, there's the seed code right there. But, yeah, unless you do a seated run, you really can't speed run this game per se. Uh, don't need that one. A lot of regular chests. Ooh, come on, give me something good. Mm -hmm. Perks! Useless here, but I'll take it. On me. All right, that's the mini battery. Ooh, that reminds me. Go ahead and re recharge my health here. Yeah, normally these guys here, you can only hit them from the back. They're kind of like the... What's the name of those knights from the original Legend of Zelda? Dark Nuts? Dark Nuts, thank you. Yeah, they're kind of like the Dark Nuts from the original Legend of Zelda. Let's see, what do we got in here? Ooh! The body gives me four, uh, yeah, three health right there. Ooh. First that name is Jesse. That's a nice item to get. First name Jesse, last name Ventura. <laughs> There's three of those. The body, the mind, and the soul. Actually, the body is the, the, the weakest of the three items. The other two are actually much better. Shut up, man. All right. Don't have any keys, so let's go ahead and fight the boss again. Oh, fuck! Not two of them! Son of a oh, bitch! The haunt! Those, those are two big bubbas. No, that's not the worst of it. The haunt is considered one of the most annoying bosses in the game. And I have to fight oh. two of them. Well, you, 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 it looks like you're going to survive at least. Well, yeah, I'm going to survive because I got enough health for it. I better get a fucking and... devil deal after that bullshit. And now you the, killed the ghosts. All right, I'll take that speed ball and shot speed up, and I'll help my chart. I'll help me charge faster. And since I know Krampus won't also be in here, also speed ball. My Bailey. I get it. You do your you. goddamn wrestling references. I swear to God. <laughs> it's not going to help with the fact that uh, Dominion's tomorrow. Oh goddamn. Nope. All right, and we got another Eternal Hashtag Heart, so we're health is filled back. Has got another heart there. Ooh, let's see Hashtag put belt on Ken. Ooh, yes. more coins, more coins. I'll take more coins. Yay! Money, 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 money. Let's see if we can game. Let's go get. Let's do some gambling. Ooh, free pill. Luck up! More luck! Oh. Now, contrary to what Money. you might think, luck does not cha change anything for those. Actually, you know what? Oh, let me go back in there because I can use this. You're literally gambling with your life. Yep. That's this game in a nutshell for you. Oh, what the fuck hit me? So, does your score actually mean anything? No. No. Unless you're doing the daily challenge runs, you really never have to worry about your score too much. Thank you, Key. Because this will be the last room that has items in it. Hierof Ooh, the Hierophant. I'll go ahead and use that now and get myself two more hearts plus the black heart. Hierophant is a very nice item to have. Ooh, thank God I can fly. I believe I can fly. Ooh. I believe I can touch the sky. Money, 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 money. Here comes the money. 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 Oh, bum, fuck. Bum, ba, dum, bum, More bum, portals. Bum, on the later bum, floors, bum, these bum. can be real. The portals can be a real bitch on the later floors because they can spawn bosses. You know, there are a lot of songs about money. I'm starting to think it's an overdone subject. Don't think that's going to affect the, this. So, 
be it'd be nice if I had regular brimstone. All right, who's got Sean's number? <laughs> or luck. Now, as I was saying earlier about luck, luck actually inc uh, increases the odds of certain uh, I random items procking. So if She's I have an item that randomly it. goes off, it increases the odds of it going off. She knows how to use it. So wait, we're f facing Mama? Yep, we're fighting Mother. Mother! When you first start the game, this is... When you first start this game, like if you start a brand new file, this is your final boss. Ah. Oh, fuck. We got this on pretty good time. I'm going to go ahead and take that. Let's see what's in here. This is the boss rush room. Two to four lovely, items will lovely, spawn, lovely. and if you pick one up, you have to fight a gauntlet of bosses. But given the items in here, fuck that noise. Nothing in here worth it. So we're going to go down... And welcome to the utero. Oh, I love that album. You know what? I don't have any... There's probably not going to be anything in there worth taking, so I'm not going to do that. Hearts with no, uh... Really? No mask? I wasn't expecting that. Usually these hearts are accompanied by a mask that you have that will, just, will, t will go after you. Weird. I'm not prepared for that. Ooh, push the button. Push the button. I have to be careful. The red poop can actually hurt you. Ah. Duly noted. <laughs> In fact, I'm At going this to point, put, that put all conceptions of, of normalcy aside. This game is fucking weird. Expect anything. Duly noted. Because <laughs> you're going to see some fucked up shit in this game. Yes. Case in point. Shit, we're not going to have time for a second recording tonight. But this is all still just the first session? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you've, been, you've, been going almost, you've been going for over 45 minutes then. Yeah, but this run was only it's only been less than 20. We just got into a good run. <laughs> it's because I set, this, I set things in my favor here by picking Azazel on normal mode. I have a feeling this is going to get edited. Uh, not likely. There's really nothing for me to edit here. I mean, like, splitting things up into digestible parts. Damn it, I ran into the spike chest. Shit, I gotta be very careful. I am dangerous low, and this run might be over now. Damn it, no keys. Oh, sh- Ah! Oh! There it is. Well... <sighs> I think that's where we're going to leave this one off. Like I said, this game will own you if you don't know what you're doing. And clearly I don't. So, next time on the RV Team Game Crew, we're going to be trying this again. And seeing if we can actually get somewhere this time. And, I'll, and if anyone bitching at me that I died too much, just know that this game is designed to kill you hard. So, this is not a Matty J scenario. This game is meant to kill you. Anyway, we'll see you guys next time, uh, everyone. Ladies! Bye, everybody, bye.